men's baseball fresh off of their tournament down at the Citadel where they split or where they finished one and two. I'm standing by with head coach Mike Gottlieb. Coach, it was the first tournament of the season. What did you see from your team out there? Well, our freshmen for the most part are better than, well, they've proven that they have the chance to be as good a class as I thought they'd be. Uh, first game we won, we beat the Citadel in a nail biter, came down to the last pitch. Uh, uh, Pete Bowles had a double and a triple, drove in a couple of runs. Brendan Butler had two hits. Um, Richie Blosser had two hits. So we got a total of six hits out of the freshmen, which was very encouraging. Now, I, that was actually my next question. Bowles, Butler, and Blosser all played really well down there. Bossler, I think, hit 517 for the weekend. Talk about what it's like to get such production from freshmen in their first collegiate experience. Well, when you, you're counting on them, well, you have to count on them for a variety of reasons. You, know, you go into a game or a season, you really don't know. And to see that in their very first college game, again, it's pretty good pitching, they stood up to the test and helped us win ball games. makes you feel good about what's going to happen down the road. Now, your team didn't commit any errors this se or, uh, in this first tournament. No, what? no, no, in the first game. First game, I'm we sorry. made up for it in okay. the next two days. All right, so the, the no errors in the first game, what's that, what's that say about your team, you know, being able to go out there and play fundamental baseball? That's why we won. And then if you watch the next two games, all of a sudden the inexperience and whatever other excuses you want to use, you know, reared their ugly heads and we didn't play very well. Uh, I'd like to think we're better, more like the, the first game rather than the second day. And hopefully we're going to start the eliminating those mistakes. Now you guys head down to Lafayette, Louisiana for your next tournament. What do you expect to see from your team bouncing back from those two losses? Well, I think going into this tournament, we have a better feel of where we are and a better understanding of what we need to do to get better and where we're trying to go. So um, there's a little bit more, um, uh, more knowledge about our team and you know, what we can expect, and yet we have a short week to work on it, but we have an idea of what we need to stress.